I was recognized for one minute. I thank, I thank the gentleman. You know, these are the same promises that we heard during NAFTA and during the Most Favored Nation Trade Status uh, debate with China. And we hear a lot of st statistics about job creation. We don't need statistics. Come to Ohio. Go to Toledo. Go to Pittsburgh. Go to Fayetteville, North Carolina. Go to Youngstown, Ohio. Go to Akron. Go down the Ohio River. All these promises were made before and it didn't pan out. It didn't work. And these trade issues are sideshows. The number one issue facing this Congress is whether or not we're going to deal with China and their currency manipulation. That bill came to the floor, this floor, last year. We had 99 Republicans vote for it. It passed with 350 votes. It just passed the Senate. We need to bring that bill to the floor and take on the beast in the middle of the room, and that's the Chinese, and drive investment back. When we put a tariff on oil country tubular goods on, in China, countervailing duties and anti-dumping, we have $2 billion of investment that now came into the United States in steel mills. We know what to do. We just need the courage to do it. And to all my friends here who are going to help these multinational corporations, they're going to get the money that they made and they're going to utilize the Citizens United case and they're going to invest it in your campaigns to beat you. It's time we have the courage to take on the beast and do what's right.